Hello guys, welcome to Trust TV and you're watching Disney Channel. Yeah. What is going on guys? Welcome back to Harari Trust TV. It is your boy Ra and today's video um, Will be out before a lot of my other videos. So like I know you guys might see the haircut and the um, The beard was trimmed down in this video, but the next future videos will have still the hair and the beard um, I wanted to make this video and push it out early because there's a few more months left of summer in a few more months whoa, whoa, whoa. a few more weeks left the summer and i wanted to just show you guys my shorts collection just what i'm wearing in the summer um a lot of these shorts i would i'll tell you guys where i wear them and if i do have any pictures of me wearing them it would be like right here i'm trying to like be on more on this side so i can have more room so the first shorts i have today will be something simple nothing too crazy minimal gray sweat like gray sweat shorts um definitely like wearing these a lot this is just this is my go-to just throw on shorts if i had anyone it would be this one because i wear this often i know if i'm going to get a haircut or something i'll throw these on i'm um, gonna put it to the side uh, i should have a picture i can wear with it before we go again nothing too simple um just basic what ten dollars twenty dollars I got from minimal uh, I'll probably show I have whatever picture I have of it will be right here um, next one oh before I get any further the camera the video quality might look a little different I want to try some new settings out with for you guys and um just keep trying to improve to get the best quality out there so this is why it looks might look a little different um hopefully let me know if you guys like if you guys wanted to go back to like the old style with like it might be a little bit more bright on the other one but if you guys want to if you guys like how this video look when you watch it let me know in the comments um second pair of shorts are these aso floral shorts this is my go-to vacation shorts no matter where i'm going as long as it's good weather i know i'm going to pack these um I paid about eighteen dollars from ASOS for this. Boom, boom. Just all over floral parent. Uh, I wore these. I got these for Cuba when I went to Cuba in twenty eighteen, August twenty eighteen. I got this one. Um, definitely was excited to wear this, and I do wear it often to a lot of my other um vacations. This is definitely like my cruise shorts where I throw it on to like a nice for the dinner. Especially on captains, like I'll throw this on the captains, like just to like look a little bit more fancy, but not feel like I have to like throw on a suit or anything. Cause um, you know, not everybody dresses up. A lot of people don't dress up on cruises, even on captains. Like, um, the next one we have are these just black recycle off white shorts. Um, do not remove off white. It's a it's. Mm, says do not remove but it reminds me of like the very like it just gives me that recycle look to it with the triangles and the um just the green and the triangles have like the color of the shade of the green i guess uh i probably don't know if i have anything with these on in it it's hard to tell because it's just some black shorts um the back is where you really get it so we'll move on to the next one Again, sticking with the off way, I try to keep them in like a specific order just because it made the most sense so I can stick with brand to brand. Um, another pair of off white shorts, red stencil, look to the back. So I'm not gonna like lie, I didn't spend that much money on like I spent money on off white shorts, but they were both on sale. I brought them two different times, both on sale. Uh, I didn't, I'm not going to spend $600 on a pair of shorts to be honest, especially like knowing that I can only wear shorts for three to four months out of the year, and unless I'm going away. But this was definitely one of my favorite, like this is my favorite out of the two off-white shorts, but in terms of shorts, this is like one of my favorite. I like wearing it, it's a relaxed fit if you ask me. Um, so I'm putting this video in the middle of well I'm putting this part of the video in the middle of the video um, right before I get into the Eric Emanuel's um, basically I was editing the video Thursday night and it crashed so I said I'm gonna try to edit it Friday but it was no promises and Friday came and I luckily got something I wanted to show you guys um, 
So I'm putting this here now, and then we're gonna get into the more the rest of the Erica manuals. Uh, or maybe put this at the end of the Erica manuals. Who knows? But it's gonna be in the video. Um. So yeah, Friday came, 12 p.m. Erica manuals. Luckily, I got these pair. The strawberry milk camel style. Um, I say strawberry milk because he said it reminds you of strawberry milk. And when you actually look at it, it does. I should have a picture with the um brown Eric Emanuel's with it with my next to my Hershey's um strawberry milk. Because I don't know if you know, like this pink right here, this like reddish thing is how the strawberry milks look most of the time. So I was lucky to get this last week's drop, and I was lucky to come across these the Fendi the Fendi logo with the double E's so Fendi E as they call it um definitely glad to get these definitely his most anticipated of the of the week um I don't think I'm gonna I'm have enough time to wear them before I drop the video cause uh when I'm recording this versus when the video comes out I'm not gonna have enough time Sorry for my voice, I just woke up not too long ago. I wanted to just get this out for you guys and add it to the collection video. We'll get into the other shorts soon. Um, but definitely two favorite ones. This is top five favorite Eric Emanuel's, I guess, I've seen so far this summer. Um, I'll probably do a list of my top fives. Um, my first pair of Eric Emanuel's here, it's like that Laker color with the white EE. -E. Um, I think I got these when they were still $88. It's now it's like 90, 98, I mean. With 98, 108. Um, but definitely, I don't wear these ones as much because honestly, I don't, the pinstripes is cool, but this is like my more so. If I'm wearing this, I'm taking it on vacation. Like, I brought that to LA. Um, the more recent one you guys saw. The all the solid yellow with the I don't know if this is still don't know if this is purple or blue. It looks blue, but sometimes in certain lights it looks purple. So I'm not sure yet. Um, they are getting harder and harder each week to get. Like it's if you don't have bots, he's getting questions that's like adding on that seems like it's good, but even then it's harder. Um, now that I'm back at work, it's getting even more hard to get just because I have to be like on point. Like when 12 o'clock hit, I have an alarm for 11.55 and then one for 11.59. So when 12 o'clock hit, I'm on the site trying to get it. But sometimes it's still difficult. Um, it is what it is. When I get it, I get it. When I don't, I don't. There are two pairs that I'll leave pictures for right here that I'm trying to get. I'll probably pay the resale for those. Um, it's like a Chanel link. If you ask me, like, it looks like, it reminds me of, like, Chanel for some reason, but as, like, the double C type link, if you add, it's hard to explain, but it's, like, jewelry around it. It's a pink one and a blue one I want to get. There was a third color, I don't remember right now, but honestly, the third color wasn't my favorite. So, next we have the burgundy Eric Emanuel's. I do mainly get solids, I'm not going to lie, I don't have nothing else other than the solids, because my thing was always... Whenever I'm on the site and I'm trying to get a pair, I go for the first pair I want. And if I don't get that, I go for like solid color, solid color, solid color. Because if I don't get, I go, I pick four basically. It's usually three solids and three, um, regular, like three designs on them. If I don't get the solid color, if I don't get the design, I go for the solid colors. If I get the design, which I've only gotten once, I just like um, go out, like I just leave it at that. But if I don't get the design, I pick like three solid the colors in order. So if I don't get the first one, I get the second one. This was like my first choice. Like every one I'm showing you guys have been my first choice when it came to solid colors. Um, burgundy with the blue EE -E hit. Uh, next we have this like khaki tan color with the green EE -E hit. One of my favorites. Um, just the color on this is nice. Uh, I haven't really, I've worn it a few times. I definitely like this one. Um, next, we do have my favorite out of the bunch simple black with the EE -E hit. Um, this is like my second pair I've ever gotten from Eric. 
it's crazy to think that like when I got this pair and the first pinstripe pair, I was doing like part time, so I didn't have like enough money to like just spend on clothes like that. Like even now, I don't have money to just throw away on clothes. Like I do strategically like plan when I'm buying stuff. Um, I can sell stuff to get stuff, but it just that becomes like a longer hassle if you ask me. And like you have to make sure the person that you're selling it to is comfortable after you sell it. It's like a whole process that like annoys me, so I don't even try to sell it. But when I got these and the pinstripe ones, they were still sitting. Like it was like they were easier to get back then. Like it's crazy what a year does for you, because now it's like harder to get. Um, but it is what it is. Black with the EEs on it. Um. There's a few if I could get right now, I would probably just purchase, resell if I had the money for. Um, it's a lot. It's a good. He drops great shorts if you ask me. He makes the best shorts. Um, another shirt we'll go right into before we get into the last pair is you've all seen this already. The Don C boxing shorts. If you ask me, Don is where. Like, he brought, he was the first time I ever seen luxury, I guess, luxury basketball brand shorts. Like, I consider Eric Emanuel luxury basketball shorts because the price point and, like, you really can wear with anything. It's not really meant to just play basketball or just, like, hang out. It's like, you can throw it on any way you want. Like, that's what he goes for. Don C, same thing. Um, I've seen Don C basketball shorts wear with anything, and it's like, when people wear it, they throw it on like with the Yeezys, the or like any high higher sneaker, like more desirable sneaker. Like I've seen people wear it the Dunks. Um, I've seen them wear it with Jordans, of course. Definitely a dope pair of shorts. I still haven't really worn it outside other than that picture I took for the video. Um, I can't wait to wear this whenever I do go away. I might wear it before the summer's done, just to throw it on. Um, Shout out to Don. I don't really know. I don't know in person to say shout out, but definitely one of my favorite, like, in terms of, I guess, designing and stuff, he has to be, like, my personal favorite just because he, he seems like, I watch his, like, sneaker. That's what it was. I watched his sneaker shopping episode um, on Complex, and he seems like he knows his stuff. He's very, like, historical to, like, what he wants to do. Like, anything, anytime I've seen him talk about, like, clothes and like fashion it's kind of like he knows he resonates more with me than like a Virgil or a Kanye because it's like he just wants to dress nice like he doesn't it's to him it's not this like it's an expression but it's like you don't have to throw in these crazy ideas like it's okay to just throw in some simple basketball shorts or have his tools like definitely um Don is one of my, just Don is definitely one of my favorite out of like, I guess when he comes to the, the design and then that like, in that circle, that whole Jerry Lorenzo, um, Kanye, Virgil stuff. So, the last shorts I'm going to show you guys, sorry if I'm talking too much, the last shorts I'm going to show you guys, never took it out yet, Eric Emanuel's, um, I was taking it about that rise, I never took them out, so I want to just break it out on camera uh, brown nice right here brown like with the bandana the paisley print on it double e's on it each paisley is supposed to be different like not only on the color but just each design i cannot wait to wear these um i'm definitely saving these for my birthday if i get to go away uh, I do have a special pair of sneakers I'm dying to get for these. I'm um, not really dying. Let me not let me not be like dramatic, but I'm definitely trying my hardest to get. I have two pairs of sneakers in general that I'm trying to get for my birthday for these. Um, if I get them, I get them. If I don't, it's always I have choices to make from. Like not to say I have the most sneakers that are, like trying to stunt, but I do have choices in terms of like the sneaker selection of what I can wear from for these. So, that was my shorts collection video, guys. Uh, let me know which one you guys like the most. If you guys need help, just 
deciding on like sizing for any of the shirts I'll let you guys know what I did with it in terms of my sizing on um, if you guys want to see me the one like how do I pick what shirts I'm gonna buy I can break that down to you for you guys who most of the time is just I go based upon price point but sometimes I do put a little bit more thought into it if I see like all within the same price point um also let me know what you guys I think I might have just said that your favorite pair of shirts you guys seen here thanks for watching like comment subscribe um I'm out of here if you guys do have anything you want to see me do check like let me know I'll definitely like try to do it any type of video again you guys should see some pictures here throughout the whole video I mean you guys seen it already then technically uh, I do have a second channel before I go I do have a second channel I would love for you guys to subscribe to it's a mental health awareness channel um, and just channel that deals with real life situations day to day and me just giving my input on it I'll leave the link to that in the description